Hiya and welcome back to a new video from me, Creative Charlie Jane. This is going to be a different video as I've never uploaded a video like this before. It's actually a haul video, um, but I will have six of them. But to switch it up a bit, I'm going to try and get three up one week and three up the next. So it's not repetitive because I kind of want all the hauls to go up together. Um, but... I don't really want to have six weeks worth of hauls so instead of having six i'll have two but that means i'll be extra editing so this week i had a lot planned and i've just added to the stress <laughs> so anyway um yeah it's kind of a different video for me um but um lockdown has happened unfortunately and it's just given me an excuse to online shop so yeah <laughs> please remember to like comment and subscribe and thank you for clicking on this video without further ado let's just get into the video thank you for clicking on this video and please remember to, to please remember to like comment and subscribe thank you let's get on with the video um so this haul isn't makeup it isn't clothing it isn't hair it isn't nails it isn't homeware it is actually something that's been keeping me sane for a lockdown um i guess we all have them days where we want to be a bit lazy and a bit non-productive so it's a nintendo switch <laughs> um this has been keeping me sane and on the days where maybe i'm not been feeling well because um i've been having an ibs flare-up at the moment um and been going to doctors and having different tests and um, there's been days where i just can't do anything i'm not productive don't feel well enough to come and sit and film a video um so i've been playing my switch i know it's not the best use of time but to be honest in lockdown what else is there to do like if you if you can't work from home if you can't go to uni you can't go out and do something then you kind of got to keep find something to keep you sane um, so I brought the Nintendo Switch Lite. It's in the yellow because yellow is my favourite colour. I brought it on the 29th of March, so nearer the start of lockdown. Um, well, I brought it on the 28th, received it on the 29th, um, on my mum's birthday. <laughs> um, yeah, and I brought two games. I've got the, um, classic Animal Crossing, which I love, um, I've always loved Animal Crossing as a game, um, when it was on DS, um, Wii U, Wii, um, yeah, definitely the DS games I used to play quite a bit. Um, everything that Animal Crossing has come out on, I've brought, I, um, I've got the app, you know, the Pocket Camp app, um, yeah, I've got that, but Nintendo Switch New Horizons Animal Crossing is just the best, um, it's really, it's different, it's a lot, like, the graphics are so much better than other ones. Um, so yeah, this is what we're playing. And also when you are allowed to go back out and say you're on a long train journey or you're in the car for a long time or even on a plane when you're allowed to go on holiday, it's just, it's so slim that you could just fit that in your bag and it wouldn't take up much room. Um, I know I carry a um, rucksack, like a mini little rucksack a Kipling one and it, this will just fit perfectly in my bag and it just I guess it is something to pass the time um it's something that kind of relaxing like Animal Crossing it's not like a really I don't know like it's not it's a relaxing game um and I really enjoy playing it it's not it's nothing too serious do you know what I mean it doesn't it kind of makes you escape from the real world and all this that is happening and everything that's happening in the world. I'm not saying that I need to escape from it. I'm not saying that it's kind of something you need to escape from, but it's kind of making me less anxious um, about stuff that's been going on. So yeah, I got the Animal Crossing. I also got the Little Friends, Dogs and Cats, which is a really nice game as well. Um, I love animals so it's kind of the perfect game for me and if you don't have an animal I know like this game it it doesn't give you a pet like if you want a pet you, you want to cuddle it you want to cuddle one you want to be able to cuddle your pet or have a like a proper pet next to you but I have two pets and sometimes I don't want to have a hug 
sometimes they just want to lie there but this pet it's, it's, it's nice to me <laughs> um no and also i've actually named both my pets on here as my cat and my dog which i have now like in real life <laughs> um so yeah this is a really again it's another light-hearted relaxing game which it doesn't it's not too much if you know what i mean some games are kind of i play the sims as well and it's kind of like it's not real life and that's what i guess i kind of love about these two games um i was thinking about getting mario kart but it's kind of like i love animal crossing and i go on it most days even if it's for like half an hour um i do really enjoy the game so i think getting another game is going to be a waste of money at the moment for me um but yeah i just love it it's really slim i love the color sorry i got the hiccups i don't know how they come up with these ideas like it's so good i was thinking about getting the like the nintendo switch where you have the two ends and stuff but i just i i wouldn't it's not as convenient as this is like i can't really travel i know it's travel friendly the nintendo switch but i'm not really gonna have anyone like what no one in my house really plays games like this they play like phone games or other stuff but i personally i i, I do like having like a gaming console and I like the ones that plug in just tell you like don't get me wrong i have a playstation um but this is kind of it's just easier like you don't you can still sit with your family and play your game but if you you've got one that goes onto the telly you'll have to go to a separate room <laughs> unless they really enjoy watching people playing the game which my family don't <laughs> i don't think many do um but yeah i really like it uh i love the color i'm really glad that i brought one to be honest because it was kind of like something that i've seen a lot of people have and i didn't buy it because i've seen like another youtuber buy it i'm not one of the people that would just go out and buy everything that someone else has got but um it's it's good for me i enjoy having something to pass the time sitting in the garden playing it um in bed relaxing on the sofa um yeah but it, it's even when i'm back and i'm allowed to go out and stuff like that i can still take this with me and it it won't take up too much room in my bag as i have said and i just i do really like it um it does pass the time you will get addicted to it i have <laughs> um but yeah i definitely recommend animal crossing and the um is it little friends cats and dogs um i would say the games for what for for the game it is expensive um i would say that the games are like more expensive than say a ds if you have a ds they're not going to be as expensive expensive as that but it's because it's a new thing and when new things come out and that this is like the newest thing it's if the, the games aren't going to be more expensive um but i actually brought digital download versions of my games off of the so i got i think i got animal crossing off of smiths and i think i brought the cats and dogs one from nintendo the website um so i i do personally recommend getting the digital downloads more because you're not gonna lose the game card you're not gonna misplace it you can't break it it's just if you buy it off of Smiths, there's like um, a setup thing, a code you've got to put in. But if you buy it off of um, like the actual Nintendo website, if you sign in with your Nintendo account, which you would have had to probably have made when you set this up, then um, it just goes straight onto your Nintendo Switch. But you like like it downloads, but it starts downloading straight away. Um, I was a bit confused until I turned on my Nintendo Switch as well. It downloaded, and I was like, for the first game, I had to put a code. The second one. I don't i don't get it <laughs> so yeah that is kind of my nintendo switch um mum and dad did get me sorry it's over here they did get me the um get, get me a case for it which i love and of course it's animal crossing um it does come with a um screen protector for your switch um it has sorry <laughs> it comes with um little 
bit here. I don't really know what that is. I know what that is. Like that is to put all your games in, which if you do have like the card versions of the games, it's really good because you won't lose them. You won't have to carry the cases everywhere. So they're quite safe in there. And this one is universal. So you can have this for your Switch or you can have it for your Nintendo Switch Lite. Um, and it's really nice. Um, again, this is a really, sorry, let me just do it up. This is a really slim case as well. Like, anyone would think that's quite bulky, but really, there's purses that are about this size. Um, so it's really slim. This will just fit into my bag normally. I could take it to uni and play it on the train, or I could play it on a car journey, as I said. It's, you could play it on the beach. You could go on holiday and play on this instead of your phone. Um, so yeah, I really do love it. I love the case. It's got the white background with the green leaf outlines. And on this one, it's got a dark, like minty green, um, minty blue, minty bluey green um, background. And then you've got the um, lighter, maybe pastel -y blue um, leaves, which is really nice. And then you've got like, on this side, you've got the mint green and this side, you've got the pastel blue. And it's really nice. Even the zips have got like, the zip, this zip is um, like um, mint bluey green and this one's like pastel blue. I really love it. And it's just, it's like, it's you can get cases for some like games consoles and they're like really bulky and they're like, that case is gonna have to stay at home. I'm not gonna be able to take my console out in it. But yeah, this is really nice. I do really love it and it's, I think, I feel like that's waterproof. Um, so if I spilt something on it, it's not gonna get onto my game. Um, and yeah, and it's a really nice material. You would probably just be able to wipe that clean. Um, if something dropped on that, it's quite padded, so it would be able to protect my game, which is the main thing. <laughs> um, yeah, I really do love it. It's really, really nice and i love it i do really love it and i love my switch um actually when i'm finished filming today i'm on the second video out of seven um so yeah i'm the second video out of seven but once i have finished filming i will be playing animal crossing um yeah i do love animal crossing it's probably one of my favorite games um and yeah, it's, it's kind of, it's, it's like the de desert island. It's like if you were going to go live on a desert, desert island to forget about all modern society. It's kind of like Sims is a game you play to create, say, a family and you play in it like an everyday routine, um, something that you could live. Um, but this is kind of it just takes you to another world and it sounds really cringy i know how cringy i sound but it just takes you to another world and it's kind of if you've got anxiety i have um it just it stops you from being anxious and it's kind of something you could play to relax you like in bed i haven't played it in bed yet because i know i stay out for hours but i could play this in bed and it would really relax me and calm me down and it's it's, it's really good thing i do recommend buying them um it's like if you're a student and you've still got a bit of your student loan um you don't need to pay any bills this is it um i do really recommend it like you can plug your headphones into it um you could you could just do like you just you have fun like come on not all of us need to be productive every single day we can have fun and this is my fun <laughs> um let's just say my family get a bit of noise <laughs> i play it a lot um and the noises are quite funny is <laughs> it is it, a really nice game and you can play like you have your photo album um i obviously i don't have the two end bits but i just I wouldn't have got use out of a normal Nintendo and I would have just I would have just wanted this as soon as it came out. So I'm glad I did wait and to get one of these. Um it was kind of like a spontaneous purchase, I guess. I wasn't gonna get it until I just thought, Joe you know what? 
mum said you don't treat yourself treat yourself to it get a game or two and enjoy it because it was at the beginning of lockdown and we knew we were going to be in here for like in the house for weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks and it's now getting into my i think my 11th week in lockdown so this has definitely been keeping me sane um i'm definitely going to be playing this after i filmed all these videos <laughs> um i i just i think it's just it's just a little bit of light-hearted fun it's it's it's, it's it is my favorite thing i've ever bought i think um it gives me much fun and it makes me quite happy so yeah i really do recommend buying one buy one and you could even go half with someone and buy the nintendo switch so yeah <laughs> Sorry, I had to pause for a minute as um, there was too much background noise and this music playing didn't want to get copyrighted. So I just thought I'll just pause for a minute and see if it quietens down. <laughs> so yeah, I can't control it, but I just thought just pause for a minute and see if it will quiet down a bit out there. Um, I just wanted to talk a bit more about the game Animal Crossing. Um, it's kind of not one of them games where you just wander around and then after a few days of playing it, there's nothing to do. It's not like that. So the first couple of days of it, you playing it, like you can't change the date and time like you could in the other Animal Crossing games. Like the, the time and the day stays with real life. Um, but the first day you kind of, you get given little tasks by the mayor of the island, um, Tom Nook. Um, and get little tasks um and he'll that will lead up to you eventually um completing all the tasks and then you get to do whatever you want but then there'll be other things that come up and yeah it's really exciting you never know what's going to happen i think that's kind of what i like it's not like a level system um you just it just like things pop up when they pop up um like a fishing tournament or um gardening or it's like um when easter happens there's like a bunny day and when summer happens there's a celebration and the bugs change and the flowers change and and the trees change it's like it's really like the graphics of the game it's a lot more advanced than the other ones i'd say um but it's really good it's really fun and you get little tasks by the villagers and it's it's really nice because if you get bored like there will be there might be a certain point where you get bored you're wandering around doing the same thing i haven't got bored of this at all at the moment um but um it's kind of like yeah as i said little tasks pop up um any day any time and you can choose to solve them not solve them but you can choose to do the tasks or choose not to um i really like it i just find it's a little bit of a light-hearted game and yeah it just relaxes me and it makes me just feel a bit more eased and less anxious i guess with what's all going on in the world so i really do recommend get animal crossing i know it's a much loved game i know that it's out of stock a lot um but if you get the digital download of the game um you don't have to worry about stock being there or not it's kind of you just get a code um, but then you, if you do want like the app, oh, just knocked the camera with my foot. If you do want like the proper game, it, um, I know like there was a massive craze for it when it first came out and it was sold out everywhere. But I feel like it's going back into shops now, not like the actual shops, like online stores. Then you can get it at Curry's, Argos, Smith's, Nintendo, um, Game, um, that's all I can think of right now. Um, but the digital download you can get at most shops as well. Um, I recommend either getting it from Smith's or the Nintendo website because they probably have the most. Um, I think you can get them in Argos, but I'm not quite sure. So yeah, I really do, really do recommend getting Animal Crossing. I'll talk a bit about the little friends, dogs and cats. It's a really nice game. So you get... You can start off with having either a dog or a cat and then i haven't worked far up yet because i've been a bit distracted with animal crossing but you can get another pet 
um i think you can get a dog and a cat and you do like little um uh, frisbee challenges competitions um you take them on walks you can feed them you can dress them up you can change the interior of your house um you train them uh, you feed them you give them drinks you play with them you take them for walks it's just a lovely game as well i really do enjoy that game as well and yeah that's kind of all i have to say about nintendo um switch light um my nintendo switch light and animal crossing and little french dogs and cats so yeah um i will put a link in the description of where i got mine from um because i'm not like they they sell them everywhere um i just i argos was probably the easiest one to get and they were out of stock everywhere they did them in other colors as well but i prefer the yellow but yeah they were out of stock everywhere so i had to wait a day for mine but it's like a day does not matter um so yeah argos i got mine from actually um and the case is also from Argos, but I think you can get it other places as well. But I'm just going to link where I got mine from. Um, I'll link where I got my games from. Um, I'll try, I guess I'll try and find other sites. But I think I'm just going to link where I got mine from because it's, it's easier. If you're living in the UK, it's just a kind of easier. And I guess if you've got Argos and you're like, there's Argos is everywhere. So yeah, um, that's it. <laughs> um, I love my Nintendo Switch. So that's the end of this video of me um, showing you my Nintendo Switch and the games I have and my lovely case. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I guess there's not much content in it in terms of it's just me talking about the game. But I guess if you were thinking about buying one or you didn't know what games you wanted for yours that you've already got or you wanted to kind of see how it's different to the normal Nintendo Switch, I guess it was good for that so yeah this is my nintendo switch light and in my animal crossing case i've got the animal crossing um game new horizons game and the um little friends dogs and cats so i really hope you enjoyed this video um i guess i hope you found it helpful or nice to just see what i brought <laughs> in my lockdown um so yeah thank you for watching please remember to like comment and subscribe please remember to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video thank you for watching stay safe <laughs>